What's going on, everybody? Welcome back. My God. Doing another <laughs> vintage cube draft. We got uh, Pocket Mike. We got Tiny Mike and B here. He's well, he's along with us for a little ride. Yeah, I'll wave to the people, little Mikey. Yeah, do your little hand air thing. You're doing good. Oh, do we take a treach? Yeah, it's got to be treachery, right? I love a good treachery. Yeah, okay. Blah, 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 blah. Nothing else really strikes me. I like time warp. But it's not a treachery, you know. I like City of Traitors until I'm like, oh yeah, you gotta sacrifice it. Yeah, every time I think it's ancient too, I'm like, that's well, not bad. And then I'm like, mm, that's worse. Time warp and treachery both let you untap your lands. It's true. Here's the mog. You ever get mogged on? A couple times. Right on, man. Right on. We can say what? Radon? Radon? Mm-hmm. Is that a card? Or are you no, just saying... I was, I was saying that because you said right on. It sounded like right on. I don't think it did. Hmm. I don't take Shark Typhoon. Maybe that's the thing, you know? You ever you ever typhooned? You ever been to the Typhoon Lagoon? I don't think I've ever actually cast that card. You ain't living. You ain't Ooh. Okay. We passed a Batter Skull. And there's a Cauldre Complete here. If I take this, what are the odds that either one comes back? Some percent over zero. <clears throat> wow, some percent over zero. We'll be here all week. Take all the wheels. What does that even mean? I, but the alternative is we take Factor Fiction, which is just a fine card. But I'm going to take Stoneforge. I'm going to take Stoneforge and hope that one of them comes back. Sharks and swords. Yeah, that's what I. That's my my. Living together. Oh, Michael, please. Ooh, Chromo Seed Shark. You ever, you ever cast this guy? You know how many sharks we can make with this, this and this? Is that some kind of silverfish? Silverfish are disgusting. Incubator racism. <coughs> oh, so it's just like another thing. Yeah, you just got to work a little harder. But incubate, you got to pay two to yeah, make it a guy? but okay. it's still fine. Shark, 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 sharks. For some reason, I momentarily thought that draw sevens were called wheels. I think they are. No, that's a pretty Yeah, common... that's a thing. Yeah, that's... You're not wrong. I just wasn't as super familiar with it. And was there a wheel in that pack? Probably. Or did you just say it independent of that? Shark, 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 shark. I think I pretty much only call them wheels. I only call them wheels. What, if, what do you call them? Hot rods. You know, I cast a hot rod. Oh, I like a subtlety. You ever cast a subtlety? Oh, that magma boy. I do like that. But now we got Stoneforge, so like we're not, you know? Wait, where's the subtlety? What? I was trying to say subtly, but because it was the card, so I... Oh, God. Make him stop. You can't. It's true. Jesus, take the wheels. <laughs> Jesus is always drawing seven. <laughs> Are you falling asleep already, little Michael? Yeah, basically. Do you need me to do you need me to rock you to sleep? Well, that'll make me go to sleep. You gotta shake me up. Shaking baby syndrome. <laughs> Alright, hold on. Is this one you? No, that's me. Alright, hold on. There you go. <laughs> hope you hope that helped you, little Michael. You're the only one with the power to make him stop. I don't think so. I've been trying to make him stop for years, you know? Also, someone asks, so we must be Facebook friends. Yeah, the rage subsided. I had a big old... Yeah, it's rare Italian you make a, a post about it. Yeah, I don't really post too often. And then I had to correct your grammar. Because as a 30-plus 30, 30 year old man, you should know the difference between there, there, I was ready there, to murder you when you And your, that, your, and your. I was going to come to the room and kill you. She willikers, mister. I I think we're just taking solemn because there's no not exciting, but yeah. Like there's no guarantee we're you playing take white. Selfless spirit. But let me tell you, man, batter skull and cauldron complete come around a lot. They be coming around the battle cauldron and then uh, every jar is a wheel. The He's right. Yeah. It's five. Man. Seven. 
That was like the wow. best card of all time for a while. Wow, man. Well, can you... I'm just interested about... Oh, you can resto a subtlety? You can also resto a treachery creature and keep it forever. Uh, yes. So we have solemn work. subtlety and treachery. There's no, there's no, I think. Resto has a specific clause where it says, return that creature to the battlefield under your control. A lot of times when you blink a card, it'll say under its owner's control. Resto, for some weird reason, returns it to your control. So once you blink a creature that you've stolen, you keep it forever after you resto. It's very Look interesting. It's a bug creature now. What'd you say down there, bud? What's that? <laughs> also, my reply wasn't like I doubted you. It was like a me <laughs> thinking of the process. Yeah, think of the process, Michael. Oh, hold on now. There's a combo right there. This one? We got a resto. It's triple red. Fork it over. <laughs> right as right. Ship it. Boros combo. Bormbo? What's that thing? You don't know what this is? It's a wheel. All right. But you got to vote. <laughs> yeah, but... If the vote's tied, it's a wheel. So, like, it's almost always a wheel. Right. Unless you don't. Hey! Want. Chippity chop, chip chop, chipsies! Oh, I don't think the other one came back. That's unfortunate. Yeah. One's pretty good. Yeah, one's better than nothing. But it did come back! Oh, wow. Oh, that's... baby right. boys! Got he. Oh, I like a touch. Yeah, see, like this one. Exile target artifact or creature return to the battlefield under its owner's control. Yeah. Oh yeah. Wow, we got them both. Crystal Giant. The, the thing is, these two are not super playable without Stoneforge Mystic. They're almost unplayable. Yeah, I mean, like that's true. Like they don't get played a ton. I guess if you have like a tinker or a or a stinker, you know. <laughs> I was gonna say the tinking and stinking. The thing that like puts it into play and you, you return yeah. artifact to you know the the. Well, the uh, thing nailed it it's like that thing that puts a big guy into play oh wow he's really you saying words yeah it puts a big guy into play and you tap it you it's know? like a creature you tap it you put a big thing into play for free jesus god make him sit that's for artifacts what the fuck are you saying if you're tinkering for batter skull you're probably not having a great time michael is so small <laughs> <laughs> this is his normal size oh god he got even smaller when he backed up yeah, this is a this is a new experience for me yeah, I think both of these are, are castable. I mean, I just don't think they're high priorities. If you have seven man in the cube, like, calls are complete. But literally, like, I would 100% play Stoneforge with just these two. Ooh, a Mox Jet. Okay. Yeah, like, the difference between five mana and seven is, like, a, like infinite, basically. It's like a thousand. Like, even in Commander, it's pretty hard to consistently hit seven lands without ramp. I feel like we just take Mox Jet here. Little Man agrees. He's yelling about it. Yeah, let's just take Mox Jet. I w I, I kind of wanted to take um, Elite Spellminder. Spell Spellminder is that his name? Because I think that card's really good, especially when we have Mr. Paulo Stoneforge Mystics. Who, Mr. Paulo? Yeah. Oh yeah, PV. Yeah. Uh, this card's surprisingly good. You know this card? Yeah, but what if we just splash for Minx and Boo? Because that card's you fire. mean Minsk? Yeah, Minx. Also, yeah, the Adrian or whatever. That, that card's stupid. Adriana? Or Adri or Adriana and Minx. Adeline. It's like it, it gets X power and then when it attacks, it makes a guy and bigifies itself. I think yeah. we're just taking Jace. Yeah, all right. He's the prodigy of Vryn. He's a prodigy of shit. Okay, that's rude. Uh, I like Thieving Skydiver, especially in a deck like this where we're kind of trying to mess with their things a little bit. It's also fine to just be a 2-1 flyer that equips stuff. That's right. I feel like Jace it is aced. good, but it's boring as fuck. And usually most decks can't really take advantage of the flip Funny, side. Funny, I said that about you. I'm like, God, it's good, but he's boring. It's true. Look at this. There's not a single white or blue card in this pack. There Which is a Mizzix Mastery, which I would have loved in my last draft because I had I had Inspired Ultimatum, Cruel Ultimatum, and Magma Opus. So you'd say you wanted to recast those? 100%. Or mm. cast them once. What colors the is the deal. try? That's John, right? That's John. That's yeah. not doing anything. For us, I'll take Sacred Foundry in case we end up having a red. No, I'll take Concealed. I think our red splash because we have Mox likely. Jet. Oh, what? okay, fair enough. We have a Jet. All right. You don't want to be Esper? You think Jeskai is more? Unless we get think... Fourth Aerolingus, which is an unreal card. You know, can, Fourth. Can you say that on the stream? Fourth Aeroling. <laughs> Wait, you talking about the Lingus? Yeah. <laughs> Katie hates him when I talk about the Lingus. That's the guy that like he's like a Boros. Is the the Boros one that? 
Jesus God. It gives like you guys counters. No wait. That's is that the one that's like a vampire nighthawk, but it's Boros. We should play stroker conversation <laughs> and then we can have a game where you guys vote on whether Michael is having a stroke or trying to have a conversation. I couldn't tell that time. So far, no strokes. No conversations either. <laughs> There's a lingus a mingus. Wow, that's pretty this good. is a plains and a swamp, so it does help that black splash if we want to go that, that direction. That we don't need. I mean, we also we'll have a talisman. Take talisman. I think mean, that's probably just for the best. It's for the best. We also just take spell pierce. I What's actually like spell pierce. Looks like unimpressive, right? It's actually very impressive. Actually... Ring tempts you every single turn. So you, and then if you if you literally are able to uh, choose a ring bear, then you just Phyrexian arena every turn. I'll take that. Well, well got a box. Spell pierce will wheel anyway. I only have two black sources, and I'm not super thrilled about going yeah, into I'm black. Talisman, then. I'm just taking the spell pierce. Really. Oh, colonnade. Colonnade. It feels so nice. I got the colonnade. I'm sorry if this pug turns out bad. She's being ridiculous. It's very cute. <laughs> it's Aer Lingus, an Irish airline. Wow. And, you know, I'm not sure. Who's to say? I'm not so positive. Oh, I like an Otawara. We could also take it's Retrofitter Foundry and see if we get an Urza's Saga, huh? Or we could just take this Gideon, which is pretty good. We could also not take the Foundry and still take a Saga, which is pretty good. But this is really good with Urza's Foundry, Urza's Saga. It is. Huh. It's also kind of just good in general. I agree with you. Watch the next pick, Urza's Saga. You ready? Here it is. Bam! Nailed it. He lied. Yeah, I did. But we got Teferi, which is pretty good. Yeah, that card's pretty stupid. <clears throat> Easy game, easy his, life. His static effect every time you're like, wait a minute. Oh, my whole deck doesn't work and I didn't even think about that. <laughs> but also when you control him and it's your turn, you feel like uh, unbeatable. Uh, you're like, nothing. You can't there's shit. You can't kill my creatures. Yeah, it's just a grand abolisher. You can't abolisher. counter my spells. <clears throat> yeah, literally. It's literally a grand abolisher. Literally. Can you just scooch a little, just a little bit? Which way? There you go. She's doing good. Okay. <laughs> a tall glass of colonnade. Delicious. Oh, he's eating me. That's like the video of the crushing dead. Uh, you know that one? No, no one's ever heard of that. Well, that means you do. So If I do it this way. I don't know if it works because it just looks like you're eating your shoulder, kind of. Yeah, okay. Whatever, man. <clears throat> yeah, man, I, I went on a big ass. I went on a big rant about Storm previously. <clears throat> I saw your post about it taking 20 minutes, so I figured you might be mad about that. I was fr I was real frustrated. I'm going to take Windswept Teeth because that's a good one. And that's one of the good ones. I could also take Scarab God with our Concealed Courtyard Mox Jet, but... But he didn't. Look, I'm going to hate this, so so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to save someone else from this misery. Uh, this is not great. Oh, um, Savior. I think Razor Ridge ticket. I wonder if that link actually works. I, I imagine it does. I don't think he's joking. I think it is literally an Irish airline. Yeah. Oh, wow. Huh. Un unjust. We went to the place where your family. Oh, the call of the ring did come back. That's interesting. AKA the Olive Garden. My meal was pretty damn good. I ate too much, as usual. As Story usual. of my life. Had like probably too, too many breadsticks. Well, that's the one ring. An academy? The one Aeroringus. <clears throat> and an Urzi? Also this Urza. This Interesting. Pretty juicy pack. I mean, not particularly for us, but it's still pretty good. We I can play the one ring and then bounce it with our own Teferi. I think we just take the ring, right? Uh, it sounds like we choose up to one creature spell or planeswalker spell. Oh, you know we'd be dipping in the Alfred. <laughs> we ain't afraid of the Alfred. I had a chicken marshal Alfredo weird combination dish, but it was good. I'm hoping we get Mightstone and Weakstone just so I can meld. I just want to meld. I don't think it's asking for too much. No one's ever done it, but he'll be the man. I've Someone melded against me, bro. 
Easy Tundra. I don't know if I believe you. Hope Miss Kalkin or Elspeth comes back. That'd be pretty sick. But definitely having a having a Tundra to go with our uh, wind blue and white teeth. cards. I was gonna say windswept <laughs> teeth. Also good. But both of those are fine. But I wanted to give you sass. Did you? Yeah. Whoa. Whoa. It was in the mist setting. Oh. Whoa. Oh. That's so fast it probably didn't even get picked up on the camera. You're fast. No. Fast talking. Yeah. Oh, I like a Caracas. This card's really sweet. Yeah, card's silly. Um... I like a wacky Karaki. That card's either a Plains or the best card you can ever draw. <laughs> oh, what up, Tom Neff? This one? Yeah. I mean, we can also bounce our own creatures, you know? Like Jace. Yeah, man, that'd Urza. be great. Bounce your Urza, you know? Yeah. You protect them. You attack and then protect as you well. You can bounce your Cauldra, which is pretty good. Oh, no, it's, creature. No, it's not no. a legendary creature. You can only bounce the germ, which isn't really going to work gonna, out for you. We're going to take that. Splash from Nath. It's never too late. <laughs> I mean, it's... No. I mean, if it wasn't red, I would say, yeah, because we have Botanical Sanctum, Razor Verge, Windswept Teeth. He's more mad than I thought. <laughs> Buddy, you He's don't know what I'm man. capable of. I kind of like Luris. Mm. Cast the parents while man, two or less. So we have... This, 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 this. Well, I guess. I mean, it's just a 3-2 as well. I mean, it's probably Winds of Abandon. We don't have a ton of removal here. I didn't even know that art. Okay. Oh, but what? That is... <gasps> oh, no! We have to choose! Five, six, seven. Three cards are coming I mean, back. you know what the right choice is. 100%. I can't yeah, pass this, yeah, but I'm hoping insane. this comes back. Exile their thing and make a copy. So good. Oh, my God. Please. Oh, it's my favorite king. I want to take this linger, especially with our splash. A little curd can read this. Curd can read this? <laughs> yeah. What? What? That's one of my favorite cards. It's one of my favorite cards. Let me ask you something, man. Okay. How you doing? Oh, wow. Esperland. Yeah, pretty good. That's actually perfect. Well, yes. And we can get it with our windswept teeth, bro. You know what you can also do? Tell me. Draw it from your deck. Draw it. Bam. Imagine spitting in the face of the Mel Dream like that. <laughs> I have enough faith that the Mel Dream will come back. I know <laughs> that the the Might Stone and Weak Stone is not good enough. Yo, that red card is stupid. <laughs> it did. Oh my god. I don't have any red lands there. Is there any way I can splash this? The answer has got to be no, right? No, it's really greedy. I mean, we got a solemn and a dream. It's a ley line binding pack, unfortunately. God, man. I mean, card no, is so good. good. Like, I thought it was good, and then I played within the cube, and I was like, well, it's pretty. It's a fireball where each point of mana you put into it is actually two damage instead of one, and it's permanent, so they stick around. And it also gives you the monarchy. So I don't. I, like, it's just like so good on every. On every metric. The monarchy. Is it Elspeth here? Or is it a Leshy? Yeah. No, nah, Leshy's pretty expensive. Alright, we'll take an L. We'll take an Elspethy. Yeah, oh, take an well. L. That came back. Sure. That guy's good. Come on, come on. Did you know Leyline Binding has flash? It's pretty messed up. It's six mana though, man. How, who can even afford that in this economy? Every time I've played against this, it's freaking one mana. It's one mana, yeah. <laughs> pretty brutal. Right as rain. What's Jake sending us? Something. Could be anything. Maybe it's a cure for my dwarfism. Your dwarfism? Dwarfism. Oh, I was hoping Anduril came back. That's kind of cool. All right, I think it's in the next pack. You ready? No, I think it's two packs away. No, I think it might be the next pack. This is an emotional roller Could coaster. Could be anything. I mean, it's kind of not that great of a card in his own, so I wouldn't be surprised if That's it what does. I'm thinking. Like, it's like, it's just way too expensive. I think it's the next I pack. think it is, too. I think there were... Oh, God. I'm getting... No respect for the crew ultimate. <laughs> oh, God. I don't think it's gonna... I don't think we're getting it. Dang it. That's sad. 
Yeah, I think someone it took it. That little biscuit. The dream is over. I don't have a dream anymore. But a life from the loam is my last pick. You know, I'm so tiny in this video. There's a chance when people are watching like on their phone, they won't even see me. <laughs> it's like oh, I was I was watching on my phone and my thumb was covering him up. You guys hear something? Okay. Okay. Can I donate to have you two lock eyes? How long do we have to lock eyes for? Are you talking like three seconds or like 45 minutes? Is there's okay without his friend? I don't think retrofitter is okay. I mean, it's still, a two, it's still a two for where your artifact incident sorceries cost one less. Mm. I guess we might just need the bodies. We only have eight creatures, but yeah, we, probably we have an Elspeth. We have Cauldra. We have Batterskull. We have Shark Typhoon. We have Fractured. We have Treachery. We have... There's something else. You might say a good Lingering amount. Souls. Okay, yeah, we're fine. Um, Cut them. I don't think he's good enough. I mean, this is seven. Actually, Foundry is probably worse. I, I, I don't like Foundry when we don't have... All right, let's run it. Ship it. <sighs> Did you play Kenrith just for a few modes? <laughs> I mean, I mean, three of the five is not terrible, but it's another five it's super, drop. It's a super, it's, but then it's really like a nine drop before it does anything, right? Or whatever. So, and we got that Caracas, <sighs> that whip, that whip. Yeah, you said Caracas, Caracas, that whip. So you got it. Bam, 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 bam. I'm watching on my phone and I can still see you, tiny Mike. <laughs> Uh, okay. Okay, so what do we got here? Tons of white. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. That's good. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Go one and one. One, two, three, four, five. Oh no, I gotta do my duo. Yeah, do the duo. You're gonna do it right now? Time's running out. I can't lose my streak. You literally have until like 1 a.m. No, it's like midnight. <sighs> Boy. I'm doing it with no volume. This is 9, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Yeah, this is 9, 10. That seems fine. All right. So that seems good. I actually do. I might like that better than Urza. What? Foundry Boy? Yeah. I think it's just got a lot of... It's close. I think it's fine either way. Ship it. He's mostly just going to be 2-3. That's not that exciting. He's Shut a 2-4. One Bort Buck. He's got a bigger butt. Artifact is in sorcery, so Winds of Abandon is cheaper. And Durgle's cheaper. That's pretty good. Um, Lingering Souls is cheaper. So three. Solemn is cheaper. Batter Skull, Fractured, Leyline, Aldra. Mm, that's kind of a lot. Yeah, I think it's fine. All right, we're in it to win it. You're a great personality. It is an honor. 
Oh, oh, this is a turn one Stoneforge Mystic. Oh, baby boy. Snap, keep that in before they thought sees us. <laughs> he's a hurt soul. <laughs> he's been he's been hurt before. You. You really do want to run the spit the whole stream, huh? Oh. All right. Now we're going to go white, this guy. Big stony Maroney. Get your daddy. <laughs> These ain't hey, your daddy's artifacts. Stony Maroney, how you been, huh? Hey, good seeing you, old Stony Maroney. What? Oh, no. This guy haste? Oh, shit. It sure do. Uh, I guess I'll just play another blue source here. Go with to haste or to flash, that is the question. It's probably to haste. V Domum. Oh, no. Well, they both have indestructible, so I would be surprised if you had an answer for this. I'm pretty sure you're just cracking a land because you need it. Oh, I forgot I had indestructible. Jesus Christ. Yeah, it's haste, indestructible, trample, first strike. Whenever this creature deals damage to a creature, exile it. That part seems unnecessary, but... Well, because if they block with an Eldrazi, you're going to first strike them and get it out of here, you know? Oh, okay. What'd you say, Michael? I can't hear you. Tiny Michael, did you say something? <sighs> Stony Maloney ordered the Gabagool. It's true. What is? That Stony Maloney ordered the Gabagool. I don't know what to tell you. You don't know what to tell me? I think our opponent's super dead. Nah, they're fine. No. They'll be good. They do have a blocker. They didn't block. Not a very good one. It's not a very good one. It's got a trample, right? Yeah. Jesus Christ. And first strike. Is that? <laughs> and indestructible. It's a hell of an upgrade to the batter skull. No, nah, man. It's totally normal. I mean, it doesn't got a lifelink, though, so it's pretty much trash. I guess. <laughs> Here's a love on Kiki G. Also, if any of their outs are permanent, it's gone. So we just actually play this and equip it to this guy, right? And then when he attacks, it makes two one ones. Yeah, winning seems good. Or do we equip it to this guy? I, mean, I guess there's some weird argument where you don't have to show it to him, but I don't think it really matters. It's just another equipment. So. Well, we don't. We still have to attack and try to win the game, you know. I guess in cube, you never know. I mean, this is nine damage. They got blockers, so. Oh, well, we just won. They got dead. Boy, Calder's a, Calder completes a hell of a card. I like the way you die, boy. I'm really glad they completed it, because otherwise... Mm, it doesn't show up in camera, but that is nice. <laughs> oh, look, we did it again. Look, we did it again. Stone Forge every game. Can we draw mocks? If you were playing against us... If we were, if the roles were reversed, we'd be so mad. <laughs> well, they might have an answer this time. No. They got rid of a removal spell. That's really fascinating. And oh, we should have went with Prime Eve. Daddy. That's stupid. I I just messed up. I'm a I'm a big dumb idiot. I mean, I think it'll be fine. But yes, you are a big dumb idiot. I don't need your sass. You're gonna get it. That's sad. I don't I tell you what. Oh, Michael Biscuits. Man, it's kind of the rubbins because they're like, oh, he's getting Batter Skull. That means he has the other one. They know. They're just going to kill it, though. Yep. I did not think it would survive this time. Drats. We don't have anything for three. We can touch the Spirit Realm, but there's nothing to target. Yeah, touch it. Touch it. <laughs> I want to see you touch that Spirit Realm. What's the channel have to Oh, uh, just blink something. Okay. It, it exiles it and then comes back at the end of the turn. Tiny sass from a tiny mic. It's like you really have a child. Yeah, it's true. He's a good boy, though, you know? For the most part. Just a little tiny. That's all. Ooh, tiny Michael. 
These new lights are way less offensive to my eyeballs. Well, I, they were at a hundred, which was, I was like, every time I got done streaming, I was like, my head is fucking kill. My eyes are killing me. This is what they were at. Oh, uh, and I was like, oh my God, do they need to be this bright? So I lowered them down to 40%. Uh, so now they're at like a 40, which is still bright enough to like illuminate. But now I don't feel like my brain is on fire when I'm done, which is really, really I'm nice. Surprised your eyeballs didn't melt out of your skull. <sighs> Buddy, you and me both. Distant from above. What does our deck do, you think? Our deck? No, their deck. I don't know. I was wondering that too, you know? They put a they've been to Prime Evil, which is white, odd. White, white, white. Maybe they gotta reanimate. You know, maybe. Can't or, think of another reason I've been that guy. Well, they probably just, it was six mana. It was probably their opening hand. You know? Well, it definitely was because they turned one. That's how they discarded it? Yeah. <laughs> well, they could have drawn it off the Faithless Looting, smart guy. I mean, I guess. Yeah? I suppose. Yeah, you didn't think about that one, did you? Yeah, a little knucklehead. <laughs> did you ever get our <sighs> water balls confused? No. What's this weird top you got? What the fuck? Where did you get this top? From the internet. Mine has like the same one, but mine looks like a Yeti top. This looks like a weird... Because it's not a Yeti top. You got a, you got a fake top? You got a <laughs> counterfeit <laughs> top? Yeah, I did. <sighs> Jesus. You think you teach your child right. And then I actually I... like this one better. How do you even know? Because I've had the other one. You had this one and you got this one? Yeah. What's it called? What's the brand? FakeYetiTops.com? I don't know. There's some Amazon third party shit. Yeti top. It's not an official, bro. This is wild to me, man. I didn't even know they made I like this handle, Yeti too. Tops. The swing ability. You like swinging? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Also, I mean, it's lasted longer than my other one did because I'm a fucking maniac. Yeah, I don't know. I've had the same top through two different Yetis, and it's still in great shape. I think you're just... I drop things a lot. Absolutely you know. unnaturally... Uh, Gifted? Yeah, thanks. <laughs> yeah, that's what we were going to go with. This is called Florapel? Florapel Strawlid for Yeti Rambler. Yeah, I think it's that one. Oh, 10 bucks. That's a good deal. You could probably get three of these for the same price as the official Look, Yeti. Funds one. were low. And uh, you know. Works fine. You didn't get this, you can get this one? This pink one? This beautiful uh No, I think the black it's like one, a blush. The black one was on sale. Black, 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 black. Yeah, it was number one. Number <laughs> one. Not bad though. I oh, like you didn't one. get this two pack? The two pack is literally two dollars more than the single. Regular nine ninety nine. Two pack twelve thirteen fifty nine. You know, I don't remember they had the two pack, but I don't think I need it. <laughs> Why? Wow, you just said how much you break things. <sighs> didn't yet. That's how Michael sounds when he's drinking a tasty, t- tasty Might treat. Be, I have a serious question. Do you like Dr. Pepper for strawberry and cream? That's a good one, isn't it? Yeah, the zero version. Yeah, we like. I we usually use the zero version. But yes, that one's very good. I've never had the full sugar version, but I assume sugar! it's probably just as good, if not better than zero. I kind of want to treachery just one of the. They have two cards. I think we're gonna steal this little little nugget. Yeah, steals little nugget. Or do we steal the the bony the boy? Ba- do you steal the nugget or the bony boy? Yeah, is it the nugget or the bone boy? Those are the questions we ask ourselves. And it comes with pipe cleaners too. That's that's nice. Michael's like, oh, I probably threw them out when they were in the box. No, I just I think I put one of them in our thing and forgot about it. Man, maybe didn't. I don't know. I don't care. That's such a weird question, you know, Garner. Why would you? Do you just like? I hate this flavor of Dr Pepper so much. I had to ask it to it randomly to everyone. It's I really know. good. I've heard you're the literally the only person I've I've seen that doesn't like it. I mean, it's definitely much different than normal Dr Pepper, but. I don't know. I don't think I care about this guy. You know what the solution is? Just don't drink it. All your dreams will come true. Yeah, like I've seen people on Facebook even being like, this is delicious. This is like one of the... Oh no. What are they going to do? Are they going to kill their own guy? Wow. Oh, that's really good. It's a bold strategy. I've done it. I did it in a, few, in a previous draft. So I, I mean, it's definitely worth it. I know that feeling. I mean, I was going to actually, so when I untapped, I was actually going to play Elspeth on this. So then I could either get back Solemn or Stoneforge. Hey, you would have wrecked him. Yeah, and then Damn they would only have him. this guy on the board. 
hello? <laughs> I like that Katie says hello as if like she's been messaging for the past 20 minutes and we're just not responding. Are they going to activate that rager? Yeah, okay. That says to me you don't have a ton going on. You know, Shooter Armor, that's okay. You don't have to like it. Donate it to your local Dr. Pepper boy. Whatever that means. <laughs> Give it to Jake. I, I think Jake probably likes it. Oh, boy. I'm drinking water. <laughs> She's so aggressive. The caps. I'm drinking water. Like a hydrated bitch. That's when you know she hasn't had water in a bit. She's got to brag about it. <laughs> We can fractured Ren and Six, shoot their face. I'm kind of worried about this Raging Ravine, to be quite honest with you. Can't deal with Rager. This guy could block a Rager, but he dies. This guy can, but we can't cast it right now. I mean, you just gotta live long enough to... To be the hero, to see yourself. <laughs> to cast Culture to Completed the villain. villain something. Culture Completed Villain something. That would be a long drive Seems for Six Pack. <laughs> That's true. I don't think you guys are very close anymore. Sure, Garner, aren't you in? Where are you in SLC? Jake is in is back in in Utah, you know. Yeah, but I still think they're pretty far apart city wise, right? Well, I don't know. Who knows? Who, who's been to Utah? You know, man, eh, once or twice. I still think you just what? fracture the the Ren. That doesn't do anything. Because then we take five, we take five, six, seven next turn. Fracture the. Enchantment? What does that do? None of these things do it's anything. A blocker. I don't know. Oh, I guess that's true. It is a blocker. I mean, it's kind of... Oh, uh, no, he's not in Logan. He used to be in Logan. I mean, he was in Colorado, and then he moved back. He didn't move back to Logan. He's like, I think like an hour south of Logan. What's the city they're in? Hey, what's the city they're in? Where are they living now? We can also just play Batter Skull and keep up like Can you pairs. target... You could probably only target non-land stuff with Touch by the Spear Realm, right? It's not Ogden, no. That's where... That's... What? The Touch it's by the... It's non-land stuff, yeah. Okay, yeah. Um, it's not very good. I'm just playing Batter Skull here. And keeping up Spell Pierce. What is Ogden, Alex? Who's, who's Ogden, Alex? Is that your friend? Yeah. Is that your little friend? It was a little Jeopardy meme. Who's your little friend? I just told you. God. I'm just gonna go to I'm just gonna go to his page and see if it'll tell me. I mean, would you believe me if I told you that I'm out of that five pounds of protein powder and I bought another one? Ice cream sandwich. Jealous. It's a good treat. I was like, good trait. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. It's going to flip into a Keekums McJeekums. Brigham City? Clearfield? Layton? That enchantment is insane. What a hell of a magic card. There's so many cards in this Just cube that going. are new cards that I'm like, that's not a fair card. Please be a spell. That's not... That is a, a bad for us. Uh, I mean, I guess we don't get cracked by the... Oh, we can fracture line. identity that, though. That's pretty cool. And then kill both of oh, these. Oh, that's actually pretty... That's gnarly, bruh. So we only take two here. Oh, I guess I don't want to F6 because they might actually just have a spell. I like how we have access to a chat with Jake. But in the chat, we're like, oh, maybe it's this. Uh, it could be that. Uh, maybe it's this. I've already messaged him. Oh, okay. Oh, Smart. okay. I didn't see that yet. You're literally in this chat and the message is yeah, there but waiting the, for you. The phone is sideways. It's waiting for you. It's over you. there. Michael, please. It's a vague notification. Michael? It could be anything. Michael. I can't believe you. What if I was kicked out of the chat? It could be from anybody. You literally sound like Devin Palmer. <laughs> it could really, be from anybody. That kind of, yeah. What are they doing now? Oh my God. What? Dismember. No. I am getting. Whose member? Your mama's member. Hmm. If you know what I mean. Man, the chance to spell pierce a dismember seems so low. And to also have our fractured resolve against this. Good, 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 got him. 
You can also kill the wren. I'd rather kill their creatures. This guy's going to make copies of things, and that doesn't sound fun. Well, oh, I guess you don't have enough to do the kiki plus the wren. Got it. The kiki plus the wren. The do, wren. Do, 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 do. You made brownies? Damn. That sounds good. Jake is Jake saw the chat. He saw the he saw the question. He's just not answering. He's being really he's being really he's, a, he's about offended it. that we don't remember. He's so mad. At the start of our dinner experience, I really wanted to get that brownie lasagna, but by the end of it, didn't have the strength. I'm tired of eating dessert. Oh yeah, we just went. I think they're gone. That's why I didn't let me reply. <laughs> Good system. That's sad. <laughs> From scratch? Well, we got a real Chef Boyardee over here. But like as in the real chef, not the, you know what I mean? No, no one knows what you mean. Tell us about your Chef Boyardee history. It's a tattered past. I can't really talk about it. All right. <sighs> Probably couldn't hear me anyway because I'm so tiny. <laughs> <laughs> you guys wouldn't get it. Now you're going to go over here. Oh, oh, I'm drifting over here. Hey, hey, look at my head. Click it. It's a play of the game, but no. Hey. Okay, he's having it. Is Michael sitting in your lap? <laughs> <laughs> no, Grandma. God. Well, that is Grandma. How grandma, you been, get off the how internet. Been, how you been, Grandma? Doing good? Yeah, in order to make an apple pie from scratch, mm. you have to invent the universe. What's that from? It's from Carl Sagan, stupid. <laughs> <laughs> so aggressive. <laughs> Correct, but aggressive. I feel like that's your vibe. What, correct but aggressive? <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Give me your fucking tagline. Oh, Jesus. Hey, he's really correct, but he's aggressive. Let me put that in your tombstone. Uh, you know what? I'd be okay with it. It's a good line. That's because of the neurodivergent. I feel like that term is really way too widely used. I agree. It with means you. literally whatever you wanted to. Yeah, man. Oh, you're a little. You got a little tick. Neurodivergent. Oh, uh, he you... likes a uh, barbecue on his uh, hamburgers. Oh, must be <laughs> neurodivergent. <laughs> uh, he paints his nails different colors. Neurodivergence. Yeah, I do think it's pretty. Uh, pretty widely used currently it, they're built different michael tell us about your 20-year feud with chef boyardee it's too traumatic that's i'm so sorry to hear that that little tappy creature is pretty messed up this is a very good this tappy creature good. oh my god they're giving me all the, like literally stone forge is a blank draw now so i'm pretty sure we'll draw it next turn are you ready yes God would never let God me be successful. Kill me first. Kill me first. <laughs> <laughs> that's a new. That's a new one. That's stolen. One. I went crazy and made smoked brisket pitas with feta spread. That's not Michael. Sounds, sounds fucking amazing. Yeah, Michael's gonna. <laughs> that's like my two favorite things. He loves brisket and feta. So fuck. You're in good hands. Did you smoke it yourself? Like fuck over millions of years or whatever? Because I think that's how long it takes. Oh, Caracas. Legendary? Anybody? Anybody? Is this a creature? I could bounce this guy. And Katie was right. Water's good. Fuck. Fuck! <laughs> What's going on over here? Did Jake ever answer? I don't know Joshua Garner. Robert? No. I like how you avoided the question. <laughs> But it means he's also like in the chat. <laughs> so no, what I told him. Are you are you okay? I didn't read your message. Oh I just assume you asked. Oh god. Let's say you in. But then how would he know Joshua? How would he know? I thought he was I just like made this weird assumption that he was like in the chat but not talking. But then how would he know Chua Garner's name? Because he has experience in the chat, which also doesn't make any sense. You're doing very well. I'll see you later. 
I would blame it on getting up at 5.30 a.m., but it wouldn't be any different if I didn't, so. Yeah. The experience doesn't really change. Yeah. I'm just going to plus here. I don't know if anything good is going to happen this game. I think they're we're just a little too behind the eight ball, as they say. <sighs> Why'd you get up at 5.30 a.m.? To not lose weight, but also not gain weight. It's pretty much my strategy in life right now. What? No one asked you that. You just made up a I'm question. A stream of consciousness right now. <laughs> but you knew the answer, so why would you ask yourself that? <laughs> I don't know, buddy. <laughs> oh, God. Kids are very happy with dinner. Well, if you have kids that can appreciate a, a brisket with a feta spread, like, that's pretty good. I feel like brisket is pretty universal with feta spread. I feel like that might be a thing kids don't yeah, like. Yeah, I feel like kids are not fond of feta. Like, you really it's got a weird... A, it's got a bitterness to it. Yeah. It's, it's a, it's, it feels like it's a more mature flavor. It's not your starter cheese spread or whatever. Yeah. What's your starter spread? Would you say? <laughs> Michael, tell us about your starter spread. If I did that, I have to kill you. If you want to know a secret, I tapped that Caracas first because I wanted to see if I could return this grist. And then once I couldn't, I decided to play the Andurl instead. <laughs> so you could it didn't look silly. Was a creature in his graveyard or hand? Which yeah, as long as it work. isn't on the battlefield, it's a creature. It's kind of awkward for that. Applesauce is delicious. I need more applesauce. I forgot to refill. Oh God, look, you started his addiction again. Oh, we need. I need to hold on. I gotta write some things down on our grocery list. Go to uh, Costco and get like a thirty-gallon oregano. Red wine vinegar, applesauce. Red, red vinegar. No. I want you to stop it. Whoa, 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 Kerwit. Easy cheese is disgusting. I accept the unseasoned ground beef. Yeah, Michael actually really hates most cheeses. He's really weird about cheese, and it's utterly unweird. It's weird to me. I don't like textures of certain cheeses, and I don't like low quality Because you're a little baby mouth? Yeah, that's why. I got, a little, I got a little root beer candy. Certain cheeses remind me of vomit, so it doesn't really work. Wow. You remind me of vomit. Should, does that mean we shouldn't be friends? I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> and why would you? Fair enough. Have you tried tahini on buttered corn? Oh, tahini, not tahini. The, yes, I've, I've had like the uh, Mexican street corn before. It's pretty dang good. I remember when we about the fancy cheese, and then we left it out too too long, and it went real gross. I do remember that time we bought the fancy cheese. That was a blast. It's mozzarella. It tastes funny. <laughs> that wasn't because we left it out too long. That was because it was bad from the place. Oh, that one was just straight up yeah, bad. Yeah, that had nothing tough. to do with us. Mm, okay. Hmm. Did I just steal this? If I play Batter Skull, they're going to do one of these jobbies to it. And I don't like... Maybe I just kill the Grist. They don't... One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, we're just going to kill the Grist here. Do it. It's kind of a pain in the ass. <laughs> if you leave fancy cheese out, it gets fancier. There's a timeline. It's like... Fancy cheese, leave it out fancier. Lift it out too long, poison. And or antibiotics. Jake's like, I don't like giving my location out. <laughs> I'm like, wait, Elon Musk? He's doxing me in real time. He's like Felipe. Oh, wow. I get a land, too. I was like when Felipe was weird about that, but then he's like tweeting from his phone, which has all his location data, and we're like... I'm like, bro, buddy. they already know everything about you. Buddy, they already know. Well, next time we can play Culture Complete, that's pretty cool. He's That guy's missing out on a free half a sixer. <laughs> half I mean, a, free a sixer. Half, a free sixer of Dr. Pepper. A free sixer. Check it and see. My Elspeth's Conqueror's Death got me a land and it killed a grist. Seems all right. I like it. Sadite. I don't like what this is going to be, though. Yeah, that's pretty good. Oh, we can steal it? 
and then play Calder Complete? Oh, man, we are going to. I don't know if you can steal it, and I'm too afraid to ask. Why can't you? It was a joke because everyone always misreads that card because it's got a million lines of text. I understand. We can also just bounce it with Caracas as well, which is kind of funny. I like stealing it better. Then you can use it. Fractured identity. We can then fracture this and kill this. I think we have a lot of options here. Beep, beep. Coming through. Check it and see. Also, if that guy's ever got any planeswalkers, dead. Straight dead. Straight to jail. Straight to the Shadow Realm. Okay, this is a lot of mana. What's cheat? Seven mana, huh? What's cheat mac and cheese? I don't know. Probably some weird thing. <laughs> That's oh, a good card. Yeah, but we got a Caracas. And, oh, we have a fracture. Oh! It still comes into play, right? So you still get the trigger? We do, we do get the trigger, yes. Oh, boy. That's exciting. Boy, oh, boy. Huh? These are your 10 cards. They got to dismember, though. Got a weird audio doubling. Oh, interesting. Okay. So I'm wondering... Okay, hold on. I have to reveal the green screens and then mute them individually so that the audio from the desk... Because I have desktop audio playing and the audio from those videos. So it's probably playing them both. That's good to know, babe. I appreciate you fixing... I appreciate you giving me the heads up there. Man, why you got that tape on your desk? Tape? Oh, so I know the area for my camera. So I know oh, the area okay. that I'm in. That with. makes more sense. I was like... Leyline you, binding. I was going to be like, you know, you can just move your keyboard wherever you want, man. Dismember. <laughs> Coalition Relic Rex Sage. So to get dismember. Inspiring Vantage? No. Relic? Yes. Mentor? No. Rex Sage? Yes. <sighs> Seachrome Coast. No. Spire Bluff. No. So these are the five they got. One, two, three, four, five. That's pretty good. They got two answers. One for Treachery and one for um, my Fractured Identity target. So that's unfortunate. But we still get to draw a bunch of cards off it, I guess. So that's kind of cool. I like drawing cards. Oh, I, I like drawing cards. Whoop. Oh, we could draw anything. Even a boat. All right, we get one artifact. I'll choose this one. One land. Choose island. Um, one planeswalker, I'll choose Elspeth. One mm -hmm. instant, I'll choose spell pierce. And one creature will definitely take subtlety here, I think. Or Resto. Mm, resto seems good. Oh, because we're going to get Mox and Land. So if they try to kill this, we can Resto it and get it again. No, it's a token. That's not going to work. We could blink this guy when they try to Rex Sage it, though. I definitely would have messed that up. Good catch. I mean, still probably Resto. Urza doesn't really do much for us. No, Urza does nothing for us. The Urza, it does nothing. Theirs is. The hell is Borzine? Borzine? I didn't make a bechamel to mix Borzin. <laughs> Say that wrong? The hell is that? Borzine. Wasn't that your girlfriend? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Borsina? John Cena? There you go. There you go. what they play? Island? I knew it. I knew you had that the whole time. Let me guess. Coalition Relic next. Oh, 
<laughs> Michael's texting, guys. <laughs> guys, text Michael. Get Michael's digits from the chat and send him lots of text messages. Command Mike's digits. Say, look, how much did this cost? One mana is the answer. The court determined that was a lie. Also, Resto says non-angel. And I think this is a Phyrexian angel. Son so of like, a bitch. So it doesn't work on a variety of levels. Right. But now they're going to play Rex Sage and try to kill this. And I'm going to be like... And then they're going to And then I'm going to look down and whisper, No. no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good times. There's a little Rorschach for you. That's one of my favorite quotes. Why don't you marry it? No. Oh, I guess they could dismember it in response. But we still got a resto. And this time we don't have a spell pierce for a dismember. Michael, you're so fucking tiny, dude. <laughs> you did this to me! <laughs> I don't think so. It's because he's in another room, you know, so he's like really far back. <laughs> yeah. I'm in the back rooms. <laughs> Yeah. In the back room again. No, oh, that was a different reference. So no, it wasn't. References. Oh, wow. Same reference. Got him. What are they doing? Let's go. God did it to you, Tiny Mike. God. What's your target? One day God was like, oh, you like being a giant, huh? I take it away. Take it away. Take it take away, away now. Take it away now. <laughs> Whoop. Thanks. Take it away, take it away, take it away now. Thanks, you really weird restoration it. angel interaction. Now they're like, oh, I guess I'll kill it with this member. This bucket's a killer with this member. I mean, he's still only got a bunch of little shitheads. So another hand is dismember a relic and two other cards. So we both have four cards, but I think our board is better. Ours got float. Another one's got lifelink. Seems good. I don't hate it. Also, you can... Oh. oh. Well. Fascinating. I was not expecting... So like, I'm not dead, but I gotta get out of I here. I might as well. <laughs> I gotta go. Well... See you later. Wow, this has wow, just been, has such, just a been such a pleasure. I, boy, boy, I can't wait I to can't wait to go home. Go home. <laughs> I do not know that meme, but it was good. Yeah, Phil Belmont. It's one of the weird interactions that we were talking about. I don't know if you were here when we talked about it earlier, but um, a lot of cards like this one. Exile artifact or creature returns to the battlefield under its owner's control. Most cards return things to their owner's control. That's what people are used to. Resto has this really weird interaction where it says, return that card to the battlefield under your control. So if you blink a creature you stole, you just get to keep it forever. Yeah, it's like they worded it differently, but like I think they didn't realize how they worded it's it. It's just built differently, you know? <laughs> yeah. You might say it's worded differently. Mox off the top. Mox, mox off the top. Give me that. Mox get mox off the top. I'd like a mox off the top if it wasn't clear. Thank you. They get one. Why can't I have one? This is worse, but there's like an anti mox. That wasn't it. That's literally the opposite of mox. Yeah, but it's not the worst draw. Why not? <laughs> Defend it. <sighs> okay. Well, there's a playable oh spell. God, they're just making a bunch of mana. All right, I do like that. That one's one. pretty good. Hey, it's pretty good. You know what? I'm going to get this cauldron complete. No way. Oh, also Thieving Skydiver to steal our Chrome Mox next turn seems phenomenal. Disgusting. If we draw Mox, we can go Thieving Skydiver, steal your Mox, keep up a white, use the white oh, and the Mox. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, that'd be good. Yeah, that would be real good. I'm just waiting for my Mox. Daddy just needs his own Mox, that's all. Yeah, when you get to steal what is essentially their land for two mana, it's pretty gross. It's got to be three, unfortunately. Oh, yeah, you got to pay one for it. Yeah, yeah. They're, they're always like, that's not no, enough. X can't be zero. We don't like that. Mm, that guy's pretty good. Cauldron Complete sounds like breakfast cereal. You ain't wrong. 
It's a big boy. It's got reach too. Again. Would not understand. Hey, you don't want to fight? No. <laughs> no, I do not. You think you win? Also, I, I wonder if I should have subtletied and put this back on top. Like for Echo? Or not Echo, but... Yeah, for Echo. Whatever that's called. Well, we know they have Dismember, but if they had it, they probably would have attacked, right? Because then they get the value and they get the Dismember. So now I'm wondering if we can just get in there with Andural. I wonder if stealing a mox is still worth it. We didn't see many other artifacts from them, though, you know? Yeah, cutting off the land's pretty good. I mean, this is just a tax for eight, and it makes two spirits. This is only a spell, right? You can't... Yeah, you can't do it with permanence, unfortunately. I might just want to keep subtlety up. You always can. You can still do the sword thing. I guess that's true. Reading the card explains it. Okay. Okay, you little shit. <laughs> it's only creatures and planeswalkers, though, you know? That's good enough. That's the only thing that works in this game anymore, don't you know? I don't know. Hmm. Begin combat. I wish I had vigilance. I wish I was a little bit taller. Do you wish you were a baller? I do. Is all just gonna happen? I guess they're gonna block one of the I doubt spirits so. for free. These aren't attacking. That's why they're behind the, the germ. Wait, they don't come in attacking? They come in attacking if you're attacking with a legendary creature. Oh. Which makes sense for the Lord of the Rings that they love their legendary things. Except the germ is a legendary, the artifact is, which is awkward. It's like it should work, but it doesn't, you know? Yes. It's not fair. Culture complete sounds like a breakfast cereal. That's not incorrect. So late to the party. See, they thought they were attacking too. <laughs> He's like, any idea why I can't block the tokens? Yeah, they ain't trying to fight you. I mean, it's pretty subtle, but I guess the red border kind of gives it away. And this guy's up in the attacking zone. These guys. He's are up not. in the zone. Get in the zone, Michael. Did not block. I see that. But they also didn't get rid of this guy, and I feel like you would definitely do that. So now he's, he's out of dismember range, which is nice. So they're have to get, they're gonna have to use like leyline binding. I mean, it's pretty hard to get rid of, to be fair. Leyline binding. Actually, if they leyline binding, I still get to keep the germ with the andural attached. So that's interesting. I guess they can get rid of the germ. Smart. Yeah, then you can still. Well, they have a yeah, they have a reach blocker. Are these words you're coming? No, no. Do you just? Do you? No, that's not worth it. Maybe end of turn you could. What? What can I do? Subbubble D is guy. No, because reading the card oh, right, explains yeah, the card. It has to be on the stack. Yeah, it's not. For some reason, it's I not a it, creature. It's a spell. Well, no, for some reason I thought it was the same as a. Uh, Venser, where it's like. You can also Creature or spell. Yeah, yeah, yeah sure. Right. Which okay. should be very, very good. Yeah, it'd probably be a lot. It'd just be a better version, right? I guess it depends on how they worded it. What are I you know? didn't know I couldn't do what? that. Really? Interesting. Are you for real? There's no. Did you? You'd have to. You had to. You had to draw that off of the, the elder Gargaroth trigger, right? Yeah. Seems to I mean, me. Doesn't really matter. I mean, I think they attack either way because it's got the vigilance, right? So, no, these they protect. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, that guy's pretty good. Uh, not much from Natari right now. What? I mean, like, you know, there's nothing in the graveyard. 
It's still a five five, Michael. Yeah, I still think you do it. Do I? Do yeah. I? I think so. Oh God. You're gonna let it live? It seems bad. But then we lose this if we if we evoke it. And they're just gonna put it on the top of their library, right? Yeah, it doesn't seem good. I can just have it. We can chump block it forever. Forever? This guy's a pain. Oh look, we got an answer. <laughs> <laughs> this is whenever it attacks or blocks? Jesus. Yeah, it's pretty solid. Uh-huh. Like a rock. Solid as a rock. <laughs> I was going for like the Chevy commercial, but that, that works too. Like a rock. There you go. <laughs> as strong as I can be. Like a rock. <laughs> this man knows his marketing. <laughs> Dude, I, was a child of the, I was a child of the 80s and 90s, man. I, I heard so many commercials in my life. Couldn't get rid of them back then. Not commercials are there five seconds or you just skip them? Well, they only have one card, but the Gargroth is going to be a real issue. I guess we can equip this next turn. So that's pretty decent. And you have like infinite chump blockers for it. For the creature with trample? It's got trample too? God. Yeah, it's like a fucking questing beast. It's very good. So many words. It just keeps happening. Whoa. You should be able to deal creatures, damage creatures while they're on the stack, and if you deal enough, they're countered. Why don't you just deal them when they're in play? I think the complexity of that is not worth the upside. It sounds like a nightmare. He just wants to lightning bolt something and counter it because Kerber likes the burn. He likes the burn. One, two, three, four, five. We have five power here. That's close to killing Elder Gargroth. But not close enough. I'm not sure. Me neither. Didn't even ask you. So rude. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> that guy again? Wow, I wasn't expecting that guy. Okay, well, one, two, three, four, five, six. I wish one of my creatures had vigilance, so I didn't have to, like, throw this into the red zone with no protection, you know? Don't you know? Let me just keep this up. I feel like we're in rough shape here because of this Elder Gargroth. It's not exactly ideal. No. No, oh, it's got lifelink. What does? I said none of it does. Uh-huh. That's the problem. Yep. Yep. I mean, I actually might be able to, like... I'm flashing and block. Yeah, do some good blocks here. I think that's about the only chance we got. Oh, I mean, I'm playing... I'm, I'm Caracas and bouncing this guy. Odysseus, have a good night, buddy. Thank you so much for the gifted subs. Really appreciate it, my dude. Keep me updated if you have any... Uh... Any updates on LinkedIn as well? Or cure, cures for my tiny disease. Yeah, if you have any cures for Michael's tinosity, let him let him know. <laughs> tinosity. No, sir, I don't like it. Oh no, he's dancing. And draw an extra card return seems pretty good. Uh, no legal targets. Click done. Like, if we can get rid of this guy, it's going to be very nice. One, two, three, four, five, six. Three, four, five. Boy, don't miscount that. That would be bad. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. And then we're bouncing this guy so they can't, like, respond. 
by bringing it back. So they can't go one, two, three, four, five, and they have one, two, three. I guess they still have enough mana. Ugh, that's painful. It'll I, be tinier though. Yeah, I guess it's a four, four instead. So Cauldre Complete can actually block it. Well, we got it out of the way, and we kept a spirit. So, and we are we're at eight still. All right, that was a little helpful. Plus, like just having this up every single turn for their stupid Scarab God is nice. Yeah, only can do that trick once. Would you? You can only do that trick once. What trick? The Gargara trick. They can only do it once, you mean? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I thought it meant me. I was like, what? Oh, good. Well, we can bounce that too. And then actually yeah. get in there for some significant damage, though. You get a lot of triggers out of it, which stinks, but. Well, there's a Rex Sage, an Assassin's Trophy. They don't have the mana for that. Did they play land this turn? I don't know. Good grief. That's a lot of things. They got natural order. That's terrifying. Othari is terrifying. Wow, their deck is kind of sweet. Their deck is like what I would want to draft. Can Assassin's Trophy at anything? Anything it wants. Hmm. Anything you can think of. Alright, so they got Grist. Did they get Galda Shrine? I found like I feel like this is an easier way to do it. No? Rex Sage. Yes. Grist. Razor Ridge Thicket. No, their land is Rafine's Tower. Did they get the trophy? Yep. Mentor. No, because they got Rex Sage. Natural Order? Yep. Othari, no, because they got Rex Sage. Forest. So this is the five they got. Okay. Rock. Don't be a land. No lands, please. Oh, wow. Kurt's leaving early. It was land. Fantastic. <laughs> Phenomenal. Shouldn't have said anything. I know. But I did. But you continue to do so. What do you want? What do you want? Causing from me? your own problems, you know. I mean, if they have Crater Hoof, like we're just dead, right? One, one, two, three, four, five. We're one mana shy of being able to activate Colonnade and equip this. Can how can they get Grist and Rex Sage without a bug? No, because you can count the Grist as a Planeswalker and that when they select them. Even though it's like technically creature too. It's like two types essentially. Yeah, it says it, it's in it, it's a creature in addition to its other types. It's not not well, a, planeswalker. Still a planeswalker. It's like an artifact creature. Activate here for four. This gives us an extra three plus two one ones. Or one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Or we can equip Cauldra for five damage. But I think my, I'd rather equip this. And then also make the one ones. Ouch. I mean, I'd rather take one and have two power of blockers. Like, that's going to be better than not having that when there's trample involved. Mm, those got a lot of floaty boys. Yeah, well, they got a lot of spells in hand. So they also have... They played Tower. They also have Atraxa and Scarab. So that's really one, two. Depends on what they natural order. That's, I think that's the worst thing. They have We know six of their seven cards. Guess what second like they had like Hornet Queen? Like they can't Rex Sage or Assassin's Trophy this. They're also not in a position to like hoof us or whatever. Actually, Hoof would probably still just kill us because we only need like a couple creatures, but Oh yeah, we'd probably be dead. Well, Hoof would give plus three plus three, so four, five, six, seven, then eight. Yeah, I guess that'd Yeah, be and we only have four blockers. So if they got well, they actually they get rid of one of their creatures if they hoof, so that's a Yeah, little... that's what I meant. So it's like close, but Yeah, it's a lot less. They could play Scarab God and then hoof this and no, they couldn't actually. No, they won't have haste though. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Alright, well that makes me feel a little better about a hoof. Nothing ever got to me. Didn't really sound like a hoof deck anyway. Is this game two? Did we win a game? I think we're up a game, right? Or it's game three? I don't even know. I feel like it's game three. Let's see what it says. It's been taking forever. We're currently playing, um, current record's 1-0, we're up a game. Okay, 
Cool. Hooray. We're doing so good. I just saw this on on Facebook, so that's kind of funny. Wow. Look, it's a 6 6 for 6 in, uh, in Lorcana. Just say, oh, yeah, it's all coming together. Is that his quote? Oh, yeah, it's all coming. Yeah. Yeah, of course it is. Wow. They got Questing Beast. Okay. They did the meme. Whoa. Are we dead? No, we just win the match. Interesting. What they do? They they, they natural order for questing beast. I think natural order is primarily for a tar- for yeah, a Traxa, yeah. which they have in hand. A Tarxa. I don't like you anymore. <laughs> I did for a while, and I just changed my mind recently. Yeah, I don't know if that's true. Do you wish this was your name? <laughs> that can't be real, right? Come on, that's got to be that's got to be made up. Who knows? Although, what a weird looking guy. That's really it's so that's rude. Accurate, I know. Like a rock. I think my body's running out of energy. <laughs> Well, we're going to the last round. Look how tiny you are. I'm you can't expire. Even, That's why you can't I can't even have I that got much it. energy. Yeah, exactly. I'm just gonna put my arm on you like this. You think this round's ever gonna start? No. Our first round opponent was called Mother of Goons. <laughs> That's actually really good. It's funny. You know what's really good? Stone Forge into Calder Complete. Good thing we don't have it to find out. <laughs> yeah, I think this game might we be had fine. A game one that was pretty, pretty juice. This card can just win you games on the spizzy. On the spizzle? Oh yeah, on that sweet spizzle. It's Marine Land. It's a weird name. Do you think this is the official Marine Land account? <laughs> the, like where they're from? <laughs> well, Marine Land is a supplier of aquarium products. Oh, I was thinking it was like some weird military reference. What Marine? Mar- like Marines? Marine. Yeah. Got it. Got it. But I guess, I don't know if it's weirder that it's a brand and this guy's just, oh, I love that place. My brand. <laughs> They could play a they could play a questing beast, so we're just gonna we're gonna crack us and keep our I fear the questing beast. Do you kill my family? I won't let him get me again. Well, technically he didn't get you, you know. He did. Wow, this feels good. Emotionally. He emotionally got you? Yeah, because killed my family. That's that's scarring, you know. You didn't even like your family. <sighs> it still has a scarring effect, you know? I don't think so. You don't know. Uh, he kinda did. You ain't my what? Thera Thera Daddy. <laughs> you like that one? I was alright. Okay. You tried. Did you? Yeah. I think you could have done better. Objectively, you can always do better. Fair. Nothing's perfect. Some nice words are. from Mutual. <laughs> like what? Reese Peanut Butter Cups? Yeah. Wallace Ray Burke. Oh, you're right. You ever seen him? Oh, he's so cute. He's always so happy. What can this be, you think? Little lingers? Did not expect that. I didn't either from the... It was a different opponent, the right? The blue, red, white, green deck. <laughs> Surprise, here's the planes. Yeah, they really got me good. They really got my... I guess g- technically with the Utopia Sprawl, they could... I don't know what but... Can you tell me what you're saying? Look, I have two cards that take their best thing and their best thing right now. Not very good. It's not very good, is it? Look at the surprise though. I could blink one. I mean, we are definitely going to play Resto and give them a little surprise in their Gee, eyes. I hope so. It'd be weird if you didn't. Okay. What if they have Lightning Bolt and we're going to get wrecked? Is that right? Bzz, 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 bzz. And a one, and a two, and a three, and a four. Surprise. In your eyes. (laughs) 
What's, you think that's funny? Yeah. I understand. D. Not D really. Rally. No, I don't. I don't. Okay. I don't understand. I'm glad you admitted it. I'm not a liar, Michael. God. That's a legendary creature. This is pretty disgusting. Is it? Oh, you can respond, though. Rip. I should go to the land, but they don't get the... Oh, that's good. That was a good... Yeah, uh, you have one guy. I can just steal her. Beefy boy. Forever. She's mine. Oh, and we have fetch land? Sick. <laughs> Problem is they're going to get another guy. This is very complicated. So we're going to fracture identity her, right? That seems like the smart thing to do. Whoa, what if? I steal this guy? Yeah. Smart. And then they're going to be they're going to be like, what an idiot. And then you're going to get him again with the Do you think I can get him twice? Fracture identity is going to be wild. Two, three, four, five. Give it to me. This is mine. I made this. <laughs> you made this? I made this. I don't think we attack here. We don't win this race. No. I feel like it's kind of the rubbins that it says owned by the other person on the card. Well, you got to be clear. I think I make two five fives now. Pretty good. They're like, huh, they're just gonna let me do it, I guess. Yeah, man, you got it, dude. I am here for you. It's so weird to do it at sorcerer speed, though. Why doesn't he just? I mean, you do that whenever, you know. Because they want maybe they want the land to get to cast something. You know, magic spells cost lands to 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 cast. What right? could be better than a free five three? Nothing. But they already End got. Discussion. They got it. It's not like they don't no. get it. What are you even talking about? It could be faster. In the flash. It. But you literally just, get it slower. Just keep thinking about it. <laughs> I don't want to devote any more brains. <laughs> To it, <laughs> brains. <sighs> oh god, I'm exploding. What are you doing? Could be better than five three. Nothing. Well, Papa was a Rolling Stone, Michael. I don't know if he was. Wherever he laid his hat, that was his home. It seems stupid. Goodbye, little Blinky. Blinky and Stinky, get rid of your man. Play another island in case you got some tricks up your sleeve. Gonna do a little fractured man. Crack your little silent clear in. Mm, crack. Oh, you're going to kill it. In response. No. You're not going to do that. Okay. I mean, Very confused. Not the worst if you just killed it. I mean, we, we, we lose 10 power in that trade, but sure. Yeah, but he still don't have it. Mm. But 10 power. All right, so he didn't make the guy. All right. Like Give it this, to me. I like where this is going. Okay. Okay. Oh, this is so disgusting. Crack immediately. It feels so good. Look at me. I have the five threes now. I'm not sure why he cracked it, but... Who, him? No, you. Because I want to get the land on my deck. What does it matter? I don't know. In case he's got, like, a wrath. What, does a, what does a wrath do? It kills your board. 
But right. I want the guy. Yeah, but you just do it at the end of his turn. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah. Why to do it right this I mean, second. it's subtle, but like... No, I mean, you say it right. You're right. I've been playing Titania for years. Smart. Rip. Rip what? Yeah, the deck's not together right now. It's not a particular right now? It's not together. Oh. At least it's, it's a, it was too good. The deck's not a particular right now. I was like, I don't know. That's not, I don't even think that makes any sense what you just said. It's like one of those awkward commander decks where it's like fun, but it's a little too strong. That's what they tell me. You know, I don't think they have a wrath, but who knows? You know, a bunch of beefy boys, they get at you quick, you know? Dude, those beefy boys they start popping off. Quick. Here comes the damnation. Fiery confluence. I'm gonna now I'm gonna I'm look, I'm literally gonna Oh, glory bringer. That's pretty good. Mm, yeah. I can't bounce it. It's not a dragon, you know. It's not a legendary dragon. I was rather. like, it is a dragon, yeah, actually. I, yeah, that's <laughs> true. As it turns out, is dragon. Get out. This is actually pretty gross. It doesn't seem good, but what do I know? They're killing the resto. That's an odd choice. I feel like letting us keep the Titania seems ill-advised. I guess it gets a flyer blocker off the board. I'm not sure I understand this attack, because we have 10 on board, so you have to have a removal spell. Did they mess up? I don't done know. done goofed? I'd be haunting if they just threw the game away for no reason. What in the earth? Oh, they're gonna do it. They're gonna do a little trickeration here. Hmm, fascinating. Well, shit. Yeah, okay. That's not very good. No. I think we're dead now. I mean, I guess we're not I mean, immediately this guy's dead. Exerted. Yeah, but it doesn't feel good. We should probably flashback our soulsies. We don't have souls. That was the, literally not this game. Hmm. That's why there's none on the board. That's unfortunate. I don't know why you thought we had lingering souls. I was just hoping we did, you know. Jesus, all of Michael's just moments praying. in time run together. Yeah, like Doctor Strange. <laughs> Just different. <laughs> yeah, he's just built different. Yeah. Yeah, he's Dr. Different. Yeah, something like that. Yes, look with your shame. <laughs> what was that, Michael? What'd you say? What? <laughs> Are they just alphing? They're alphing? I guess we'll block here. And then bounce our Urza. Whoop. So far, our last two opponents have had Assassin's Trophy, so that's interesting. What can we draw here that'd be really good? Now we're out of fetch lands. Oh, that's really wow, that's that's something. That's a thing. Seems good. Zoranorb would be nice. Do we have a Zoranorb on the sideboard actually? I would almost be tempted to board it in in case we can get their guy again. No. I kind of like Containment Priest against them, though. They have Lingering Souls and Titania. One time, just playing Titania. I Zorn Derbed, but I floated all my mana first, and then I Final Destination. Whatever that card's called. Final Destination? <laughs> like the movie? Wow. <laughs> Final Devastate, the, the green one. Finale of Devastation? Yeah, I mean, Final like. Final Destination? I mean, like, 100 five threes and then. Gave everything plus 100 plus 100 is pretty gross. That seems like, like it's really hard to keep track of in paper. I think I did like, we didn't do the actual math, but it was like over 50k worth of damage. Pretty silly how it gives all your stuff haste. Look at all them worm boys. Boy, they're really having a good time with the skull clamp. Yeah, we're pretty dead. Like, we are dead, but now they got a million cards. It's going to be mocks. We're still dead. Elspeth conquers death, huh? I mean, a little too late. You know, it probably is a little too late. They got a bunch of I don't of think we're going to conquer death here, I'll be honest. Fair. Well played. Maybe a turn sooner. 
If a non-token creature went on the battlefield, so that doesn't actually do what I want it to do. Yep. Yeah, non-token's really relevant there. <laughs> seems seems good. I wonder if this guy's any good. No. But maybe. I'm gonna no. play it. Why? I think it might be better than like Urza. Not a high bar, but okay. <laughs> wow, you're being it's got, really it's, rude. It's got one more power. <laughs> Yeah, but it keeps getting the abilities like every turn. Eventually, you're gonna have like a vigilant, hexproof, lifelink, first striker, with fly. Like it's, yeah, but it only gives them once, right? It doesn't. It, it gives each ability one time. Yeah, but every turn. Yeah. The beginning of combat on your turn, choose a kind of counter at random. It's kind of slow and weird. Yeah, but like they didn't have a ton like of removal. Either. And if it's the first thing you want is always hexproof. Like you always, if you get hexproof first, Which means you'll never get it. That thing's just gonna. Yeah, if you get hexproof first, it's probably insane. But I mean, Foundry's probably fine. I don't know if it's like. I wonder if. I don't feel like it does enough. Like, what is it? Like the creatures we had a problem with were like Titania, which it doesn't really. One ones don't really hold up. Also, to they showed like Rex Sage and a bunch of other stuff. No, Rex Sage was still the other round. They did not have or Rex Sage. Oh my god, it was so confusing. Jesus, they're all a bunch of green decks with all the colors. Who can keep up? A lot of people, I think. No. Oh, my mistake. I've made a terrible mistake. I apologize. It's good. Man, Titania is pretty annoying. Remember when we cast Lingering Souls and then our opponent cast Rex Sage in this game? Wow. Yeah. I remember like it was yesterday. <laughs> well, it wasn't. It was today, dummy. <laughs> Got him. Feels like yesterday. I mean, Kenneth is fine. I don't know if I need another five drop in the deck, though. I'm trying to play earlier things. It's a that... little slow. Right. I mean, again, like this, these are all great cards. Like if we have. If it's like turn eight and we need a mana sink. I think the early game is what matters here for the most part. Yeah, I really kind of keep wanna I wanna keep drawing our mocks into our stone forge, but they're not letting us do that. I feel like outside of skull clamp shenanigans, we do have the better late game. You don't know. Mox. Dang it. Dang it. That card's not on our deck, I'm pretty sure. I think he took it out. I literally haven't. I think I, no, we drew it. We drew it in, the, in like game one, match one. Yeah, when we didn't need it, and we absolutely crushed them. <laughs> it's not worth saltying. That would be wild. Oh, little sharky boy! Mm. That was unnecessarily loud. I pointed away. It sounded like a a whale. It's rude. Was it? Yeah. Or was it true? Which do you think? Something oh, that's wow. true can also be rude. No. Yes. No, if it's true, it's not rude. That was a lie. No, that was true. No. No. Calling it in the house. Papa's in the house? Yeah. That thing's got flying too. What a good little shark. It's a shark. Of course it has flying. <laughs> <laughs> Why do all these sharks fly? I don't understand. Why don't they swim? Because they're robot sharks. It is weird that MTG is like, yeah, there's a shark, it flies. And you're just kind of like, yeah, of course. I mean, I, I knew I it had flying it because it's it was like, a shark. It can, like, it can swim, so like has evasion, and they don't want to make swim a thing. So like flying kind of makes no, sense. No, that makes weird. literally no sense, and I really don't know what you're thinking. I mean, not in a flavor sense, but in a like. Nope. <laughs> if you're in the water with it, it has flying. No, what? It has flying in the water. Don't you understand? On the battlefield of water, it flies. Prove me wrong. You can't. Shut up. <laughs> I award you no points. <laughs> you know that on the board anymore? No, that was never on the board. It needs to be. I feel like, oh man. I've never had that and it really should be. Maybe it's too long. Look at this. Look at this guy. Look at this frigging gay. This guy seems really good for them, but they're just going to cast it again next turn. Oh, we can just touch the spirit realm. Yeah, just touch the spirit realm, bro. Just touch it, bro. <laughs> You ever touched it? Just touch it. In all situations, Omnath is always the card that man, it seems really good for them. <laughs> you know the thing says draw a card when it enters the battlefield for no reason. <laughs> oh, they got an Oko too. That's I think that's great. actually fine here. It's not great, don't get me wrong, but Okay, I won't. Okay. You're gonna turn that into an elk? 
Joke's on you. I love Elks. Well, the thing is I have Elspeth. That just gives us plus X, plus X, and float. Until it's an Elk. Land. Really wanted a land, but I guess that's fine. It'd be better if you had a land. Mm -hmm. It'd be a lot cooler if I did. Yeah. Um. Well, here's what, here's what we can do. Touch them. And smudge them. Yeah, look at all those little little pots you're making. They're gonna grow up to be big and strong one day. That's a hell of a shark, man. God dang, bro! I don't mess around. That shark's got a with my sharks. That shark's got a got teeth spot in my deck. What? I gotta put in a deck, huh? It's an artifact deck. Said is one of the most insanely <laughs> idiotic so things I have ever heard. At no point in your rambling, incoherent response. That's so long. God, it's like 20 seconds, man. That's probably why it's not on the board. <laughs> also, I'm probably just going to get demonetized Look, look for at it. these cliffs. Wow. Really? You're going to give me a land? God, it's so nice of you. It's actually pretty good for us. That's really good for us. What are these swords? Also, this is a legendary creature now. I can bounce it with my own Caracas. Oh, wow. They have one card in their hand. What's a wild interaction? Yeah, okay. I wonder if you do bounce it now or just leave it as a little guy. Um, Bouncing it, I, one, two, three, four, five. No, I just rather have a creature for now. I ain't gonna win me any games by being in equipment with no creatures. It's only if you don't hustle hard enough, right? But I'm not hustling hard enough. I hustle at a reasonable pace so that I don't overexert myself. <laughs> huh. Yeah, it is a reasonable answer. It has to be sustainable, Michael. Your hustling has to be sustainable. Are Your they bitch. considering killing their devoted druid too with their clamp arena? It was a call to the movie, right? I don't know what that means. Yeah, I don't know, man. I think he's crazy. Is this legendary? No, you can just have a bunch of these. That's nuts. Nuts. Call the movie. It's the movie phone. Oh, can we just steal their skull clamp? For three mana, yes, you can. That's a deal. Wait, it does cost one mana, right? Uh-huh. Okay, make sure I'm not an idiot and cause us to lose the game. Well. You know, just in case. Just for fun. Cause the rain. Give me that. Give me that cl big clizzy. <laughs> Wait. Oh, if it's an equipment, it gets equipped to it. That's cool. I forgot about that, but that kind of works out for that us. That works out a lot for us, because now we can either play Jace or play an Incubator. And we still get to keep the gun. Because I was going to do that anyway, because I wanted to hit a land drop. So that's just a free bull. Accidentally the best play. I definitely see a world where you accidentally clip it to like 4-1. You're like, oh no. It's dead. Yeah, we're just getting in there. Look, I feel like I'm attacking with Aragorn. <laughs> I mean, you, you are in a way. In a way. Michael, look how tiny you are, man. That's wild. Can't believe you're so yeah, tiny. Yeah, I've been slimming down. You know? <laughs> I overdid it a little bit. <sighs> I get it. That's why I did that big pasta dinner, you know? Big pasta dinner. Gotta walk back up. Yeah. yeah. He's a tiny boy. He was a tiny boy. And I wish that was my problem in life. That you were too tiny? <laughs> yeah. I think you say that, but I think Scrawny guys got it real rough, too. It depends on Look your at goals. Chris Furter. Chris Furter wishes he could put on some weight. Oh, they're just cycling their lands here. Yeah, that guy feels like a strong breeze and he's going down, you know? I love little Michael. <laughs> yeah, he's having a good time, you know? It's the two, it's the two halves of the... The gym bros. Oh, the right. ones that are too small and the ones that are too big. Yeah. The ones who, whose calves can never get bigger. <laughs> yeah. And uh, then there's the guys that have won the gym and shouldn't be there anymore. On the bright side, this video will be in 4K, so, you know. See all the little details. Yeah, they'll be able to see you really like well. Like me. You think they're killing Jace or, or Aragorn? Oh, wow, really? This is going to be fun. <laughs> Give Surprise. it to me. 
You can kill it in a way, but not the way you want it. That was that was that felt like a next level play. Yeah, I don't think they realized that. Because now we get to cast this and equip it and attack. We start attacking with Jace too, so that's kind of cool. <laughs> Is he the devil or the angel shoulder? <laughs> One, two, three, four. I can be your devil or your angle. I can be your devil or your angle. Oh, we're just gonna win the game. Sounds good. Deal. All right, we're one game away from uh, 3-0 in this bad boy. Wild. Wild. I always feel like the decks were like, yeah, it's kind of okay. Do the best. <laughs> Am I your chapstick? <laughs> <laughs> I can be your chapstick, baby. <laughs> it's like, what is he going for here? They call him Lil Chappy. Y'all know about Lil Chappy? Come on, Mox Jet. One. <clears throat> Second turn Jace is okay, though. Be a lot cooler if it was turn one. Well, I don't. Yeah, we can get a Tundra with this if we did happen to draw the Mox, but I don't for, I don't foresee that happening. I knew it. That is the first time we've drawn that card, though. I, didn't, I forgot that card was in our deck. Me too. Oh, see, now I'm like, I'm curious how that's going to impact our game is because. Going up to the to the to the ring tempting you very very quickly is fairly strong. Let's get our Rafine's tower. Now you're just now you're just being a dick. I think it's still a pretty good draw. I mean, do we lingering souls here? Or yeah, because just... then with the ring temp the ring the ring daddy's better, right? Well. Kind of, yeah. But I mean, we could also have done it to Jace too. So. No, but we want to tap in that guy. We don't want to be attacking with him. We don't want to be attacking. To get that filter in, you know. I mean, if we draw another land, we can go call and lingering souls, which would be great. <clears throat> Jesus, are you exploding? Yeah. Wild. <clears throat> that guy's good. Are you gonna make my? No. T no. He's gonna make. A food. He's hungry. We did draw land. Great success. Now I'm tempted to just touch the spirit realm on this guy. Just touch it, you know? Just give it a little tap. <sighs> Boy. Are you okay? Yeah, I guess. Let's call. And then... Flashy. Better call Flashy. Let's hit Oko because I don't want them to take anything of ours. Smart. You're in a great position when all your creatures are worse than the 3 3 elk that Oko could give you. Because then they just have to like I make dare food. You. Unk. I dare you, little piggy. <laughs> also, the looting effect from Call of the Ring is. Oh, oh, we get to play two and draw a card too next turn. Good lord. Call of the Ring feels really good. It feels really good. <laughs> like, is he part of Frank's arm? <laughs> Come on, you guys know who Michael is. We can put him on the side, too. You want to put him on the sidewall? Here, we'll fix him. There we go. This is... Wild. Little Michael. This is uh, not your standard setup, you might say. No, this is Vintage Cube, not standard. I thought it was Vintage Setup. Vintage Setup. Smart. Yeah, put me back in the pocket. <laughs> get, get over here, you little, you little rascal. In the old, you know. I wonder if I should have blocked there and just saved three. No. Don't be a little bitch. No. Out, am I? He's not winning the race. You don't know what he's doing. I have a good feeling about it. I guess if he makes like, some weird word where he makes a food and then makes a game. Hmm. The ring calls to me. Oh, that was like... That was like butter. That was like butter. Oh. Bu I'm tempted to steal. Mana? I'm tempted to just steal this and go all out and just like play these two. Get rid of Oko. Attack for a bunch. 
Uh, let's see if we can do it. Like, I'm just really trying to, I'm just trying to make my board position grow, you know? You grow your Borg. Actually, maybe this is the better play. Why? Because it feels like they need mana. They didn't miss a land drop, though, right? I guess they didn't. Is or do you know they didn't? I don't know, man. But them having uh, like access to red seems good for like Omnath. Plus, I don't care about this. This I'm going right. to take. That ain't a land boy. A land boy. I saw you looking at it like it was land. I did. I was looking at it like it was a land. Tried to cheat. Didn't work. Jump, jump, jump around. It's got double jump. Uh, attack Oko. Oko. Your face. And your face. All right, so Oko's dead. That's nice. Always a good thing. Always a good thing. That guy's a son of a bitch. So juicy. This is like a, is this like this is like an emblem. You know, Oko's also really messed up in Commander. Nice commander. It'd be a shame if it was a useless 3 3 forever and there's nothing you can do about it. No, man. You could kill it and it goes to the Yeah, gra- kill your own guy. When it goes to the graveyard, is it still an elk so it doesn't trigger the commander rule or you can put no, it back? No, no, no. That's not how that works. That would be terrible. It, if switches, it, was. it switches zones. So that trigger always applies when it switches zones. So, like, if it's in your graveyard and someone exiles it, you can. You can... Hmm. I feel like that's just going to kill him quicker, you know? I still think you probably take it. Choke him out of his resources, you know? And we get to loot here. You know, I don't know if it's Wednesday. My dudes! But I could be wrong, so... Target creature gets plus one string, it's flying. Is that correct? That feels correct. Yeah. Maybe we just make a blocker here. I think it's better to make a blocker. What are you scared of? Dying. <laughs> Scared of death, Michael. I mean, you already had a blocker. Oh, wow. We can Elspeth Conqueror's death this thing. That's kind of cool. Is it not an instructable? That's, this is Exiles. Smart. Oh, also they have this, so I don't know why. Actually, do we Leyline Binding pre-combat or pre-damage? That's tempting. Well, it's only they have protection and everything, right? Not their permanents? Yeah. Which is a very confusing rule, by the way. I have protection for everything, but not my stuff. Because I feel like your stuff is part of you, but whatever. We also don't have a creature, so it might just be orderly line binding, but this hits everything. Five. Yeah, no, I'd say the binding. Plus, it's got flash. Surprise. It's true. What's it cost right now? Three for us? Yeah. Still pretty good. Is it white? Mm hmm. Because white doesn't count, right? As part of the reducing. One less for each basic land type. No, who cares? Okay, so it's three. two? It's three. It costs six. I have three types. Six minus three is three. I still don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. Uh, slow down. That was slow good. down. Carry the one minus the seven. Also, look, they it's turn six. They still only have four lands. Okay, so... Don't talk to me about they they got all their lands. I mean, I was also right at the time that they had. Yeah, but you didn't have land. the intuition that you needed to know. I'm not saying what you did was wrong. I'm just saying I was right it feels in my like, statement. It feels like my statement is correct. Goodbye. It feels like you're accusing me of being wrong. Even though once you mentioned that they might need red, I agree with you. But you're still being a little bitch about it. Yeah, flick me. <laughs> Whoa! I went the other way. Oh, they're playing a Savage Knuckle Blade. And that would be a treat. Uh, I don't think it's in the queue, but... Oh, shit, they're playing Sprouting Thrinax. Or that weird new Toad guy. Oh, the Toad guy. <laughs> like a weird mill guy. Grist. Jund. He make it a Bugs. They're just killing our Elspeth, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. But now we can get it back with... I literally didn't have a target for Elspeth Conqueror's Death, and now I do. So that's cool. Do so you want to figure out a way to make your whole deck insects and then mill your deck with Oh, wow. Guy? Look at the things that I've done. 
One, two, three, four, five, six. I still have 17. Because we haven't been attacking them much. We killed their Oko one turn. Oh, yeah, that took a lot of... Yeah. Uh, attack, Grist, attack your face, your face, and then your other face. All of your faces. Thieving Skydiver. I don't think we can steal anything here. Uh. Touch the rain. Is she holding the cube? Which one? True question. Which of the three or four <laughs> that, that you... Or however many. Six. We have six. One, two, it's three, weird three, that four, five, six, the newest seven, one is five. just called Shieldred. One word, right? I think. I don't know. It's confusing. You're doing good. I want to take out Stoneforge. It feels like the least. Take it out. Ta I'm taking it out. Terminate it. <laughs> huh. So we're going to go. Stoneforge on turn seven. You disgust Jeez. me now. And then one, two, three, four, five big baddies. Yeah, give him the big baddies. Give him his baddies. I mean, I feel like we're in a good spot. Uh, you know. I agree. I didn't see anything that could really disrupt a board state like this, especially because next turn Elspeth is going to bring Elspeth back. Also, unless they've hit it really well, I don't think they got any combos we got to worry about. With five mm -hmm. mana? That would be really cool. You okay. Can get more. That's, that's not it. See, that's more mana. Well, I'm just talking about, about the, what they can do right now. The snake combo? I don't, but I do know we just 3 0 <laughs> so that was okay. pretty cool. Thank you guys for watching. Check out HelloFresh. You can get 50% off your first box and free shipping. I know you probably clicked off the video by now, but if you haven't, definitely consider it. The link's down below. Down below, it's a great deal. I had it. It's Be sure good. to follow and subscribe. Everyone, everyone who's had it loved it. It's been very good, and that's a great way to support the channel. Click those like and subscribe buttons. I'll see you next time.